Hello everybody, this is Darth Lego 2002, Darth Lego 202 Second Channel, and Hezzer Zid, stop mocking me, but today as always, I'm here with Hezzer Zid, I always mock you. And also your Jack, Jack 100. Mm, there's a, there's a, there's a, there's an imitator over there, I don't like it. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, Robin. Listen, how be, is he Roy, be quiet. <laughs> Roy, be quiet. Well, I'll hear her. <laughs> Roy, I'm gonna get Batman on you. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so today, uh, I've been realizing lately that I've been showing a lot of customs on my first channel that I haven't shown on my main channel, on my second channel yet. And as you know, the rule apparently used to be, apparently it's not the rule anymore, yeah, you that, it, not us. that, um... Not that I would always show customs on here before I show them on my main channel. Mm. But the thing that got in the way of that is me doing big themes of customs and not having time for little random videos for the, uh, for these sets of customs uh, in between. So, yeah, today we have Ocean Master and Queen Mera from the uh, Aquaman. Uh, also from uh, from the Shut Aquaman out. series. Yeah. Arsenal from the Green Arrow series. Mm -hmm. John Stewart and Guy Gardner from the Green Lantern series. Mm -hmm. Um. So let's That's begin. The one? What? Oh, okay. What? Guy nothing, Gardner? Nothing, nothing. John Stewart, yeah. No, the one next to him. Guy Is Gardner? that the one that goes like, ah. Yeah. All right. All right. Anyway, uh, okay, so today we have uh, Ocean Master. Okay, so. Uh, not too much to say. I mean, like, it's a pretty basic design, mostly based off of his uh, Golden Age design because of the really bright helmet, the red eyes, and the really bright red cape. Hot brother! Dude, that actually scared me. <laughs> I know, I was attempting to do that. <laughs> Only fans of my main channel would get these jokes, by the way. Um, and, you know, the really, br it's just the bright colors on him overall. It's really based off of his Golden Age costume. And overall, I think it turned out really nice. So then we move on to Queen Mera, who... I I've just come up with a new color for red. Uh, and here's the thing, um, with Queen Mera, if you watch my main channel, shut up, if you watch my main channel in the Aquaman series, Queen Mera is always just kind of there. Like, you know, she's an existing character, but you'll notice that she never talks. Uh, she was in Aquaman episode 2 and Aquaman episode 5, yeah, because he's talking to her. Yeah, I know. I only, I only voice act. Yeah, oh yeah, right? <laughs> Um, but yeah, overall, I mean, I really like the design. There's not too many ways to change the Mera design. I think the only way I could have really changed this to kind of modernize it is to go off of her new 52 design and take away the cape. Uh, the, uh, the head and the hair are just pretty basic designs overall. Uh, I forget exactly what the head was, uh, the design here. I think it was from the Harry Potter series. Harry Potter series. I think I said Harry Potter. Did I say Harry Potter? I don't know, yeah. It's Harry Potter. Anyway, uh, I think it's from the Lego Harry Potter line and uh Who's hair. What no no the head piece. Oh the head piece. Like the head hair. piece. Uh I I can't it was one of the Weasleys. I can't I can't remember if it was Ginny or if I used Molly's hair headpiece. Uh that's how you say it. I thought it was Ginny. It's Ginny. That's no the way it looks in the books I can understand it's it's coming from What, because it's not spelled with a J? No, it, That's why I looked at it, right, to be honest. Nah, I always thought it was Ginny. Uh, anyway, so then we have Arsenal, Roy Hart. <laughs> just because my Arsenal voice resembles your Robin voice. It's just like means, it. What, what artist, are you talking what about, artist, Robin? <laughs> what, hey, Jack, one artist takes from another. Exactly. So and you're following the great one. Well, you see, like, you see, like, the, the joke... <laughs> The joke always on our main channel is that uh, Green Arrow is always is so much like Batman, so it's just like, oh, why aren't their sidekicks alike? So you know they even talk alike. It was the joke there? So I still find it somewhat like that. Uh, mostly based off of his um, his I think it was his early two thousands costume, uh, if I could if I remember correctly. But either way. Uh, just overall, you know, just red hood, um, red mask there. Yes. Uh, pretty you basic. Called. What? Red hood, did you call? Oh, shut up. Uh, pretty basic body design on the front and back. Uh, and just, I think I actually used Deadpool legs for that, but it just looked nice for the actual figure. Uh, then we have John Stewart. Uh, and John Stewart... I pro the only real problem that I have shut up Jack the only real problem that I have with this figure is how I did the eyes but really no matter like seriously the more I added onto the eyes the, the the worse they looked so I'm just leaving the eyes like this other than that though he has really short hair and uh, at least in current comics I think he had like a 
think I actually got, like pretty much had an afro in the mm. older mm. comics. Mm. Like, Gee, in, I in wonder why. I wonder. Mm. It, it was a very it, seriously like uh, like to get into this subject in the seventies. Like they, he was very much an African American stereotype when they first introduced him in the in the seventies. I can only seventies or eighties. I think. I say man. Well, think about the her, her style. So exactly. So, I say it's most likely the eighties. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm not sure. I think he was actually like late seventies to be honest. Well, either way, they definitely embrace a stereotype. We, yeah, which, and like even like the first issue that he was in, it was like all of the comments were really racy. Like uh, even from Hal Jordan, like Hal Jordan was working with him yes. for the first time in the Earth sector. Yes. I'll be quiet. Uh, shut up, Hal. Um, <laughs> Hal Jordan was working with him for the first time in the Earth sector. Uh, I forget the exact number. Um, and it's just like the comments that Hal Jordan made, just like that everybody made to him. Just it was. Wow. But anyway, this is current John Stewart. He has really short hair. Is what is how this conversation started. How was the conversation and it, with that it reflected the times? Yeah, pretty basic Green Lantern suit, and then Guy Gardner, of course. What no scream? Of course, shut up. Of course, his very basic, uh, not very basic. Uh, his very unique uh, yeah, uh, Green Lantern. Like, he's quite unique. His Green Lantern costume that he made for himself. Uh, if you read the Zero issue of the Green Lantern Corps in the New Fifty Two, which is a really good issue, by the way. It was, uh, <laughs> partially off topic. It was uh like when he joined the Green Lantern Corps, he was just like, oh yeah, I don't like this basic costume. And he completely changed it. And, uh, just a fun little backstory there. Uh, hair piece I think definitely resembles current Guy Gardner, and as well as the hair piece, uh, head piece I should say. All right, so let's get my let's get favorites. Personally, my favorite here is Mara. Uh, what about uh, Hezzers? What is Hezzers thinking? What is your favorite? Well, first and foremost, I want to quote on uh, Ocean Master. All right. I think I agree with you completely. Mm -hmm. Oh, like based off the golden yeah, age. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, they're all very nice. I, I you if anything, say that. if anything, Roy is my favorite. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I, I'm gonna go check sound that okay. way. Okay, see what happened. All right, uh, Jack. What does Jack think? See, I ch I would choose the guy in the middle. But you know, he's really. Oh my God, Jack. Eh, I have a little bit of a bias for some reason. I don't know. Um. Uh, what are you? All right then. Yeah. Ah. Hezzer's Hezzer just completely left the room. How am I gonna do the outro? Yeah. Yeah. So right. weather today. Uh, yeah. right. So until next time, this has been Darth Vader 2002. Hezzer said. Wait, what? what? This is how Hezzer sounds. It sounds like this, you know. It sounds like kind of like this. Okay. Okay then. We'll just pretend that's how he sounds. All right. Hezzer said. And as always. <laughs> it's not working. <laughs> Don't you love base plates, Jack? No, I don't. <laughs> Goodbye.